hi friends um, today I wanted to show you how we can use git autocomplete on a new Mac okay. typically when you are using git on your Mac Xcode by default gives you the basic git client installed all right so you can readily use git on your Mac the moment you install your Xcode okay so but the problem that I face with this git client is I do not see a auto completion feature right so when I hit a tab I do not see the branches or anything so this actually makes it more tough when you have multiple branches in your git with longer names right so one way to do that is every time you want to switch a branch copy the name and use it in your git checkout coming from a windows user i got so very used to this autocomplete on git client and i wanted to set it up on my new mac right and doing a lot of research i was able to find a way to do that and today I'm going to show you on how you can do that right so let's take a look uh, in Git, basically if you there is uh, git tips and tricks they have clearly documented that auto completion is possible on Max and they have a script that is maintained in open source on the github side to enable this particular feature right so I just went into this particular URL and saw the script and it's quite a big again. So what we can do here is take the raw file, copy the URL and download it. I'll take a new tab and I'll typically download it onto my local and call it git auto complete dot bash All right so the moment it downloaded you can see this you can just do a cat to ensure that you have the whole content All right okay it looks like we have downloaded properly so now what i'll do is i'll go into my dot bash profile or bash rc oh sorry <laughs> vi dot bash profile and i will say source use this file as my source right So the moment I do that and reload my profile, I can see the auto completion working, right? So if I say git checkout feature, I can just type F and I got my branch name. In the same way, I can see git checkout. Let's see what are the branches we have. Git branch. So we have a bug fix branch, a dev branch, and a feature branch. Let's create another bug fix branch for us to test, right? Git checkout hyphen B. Um, let's try to check out the bug fix branch. I just typed the by and I got my autocomplete working. Right? So now it's very easy for you to even see what all commits or what all commands you have right and you can basically see how how can you use your git and stuff like that so this makes your life a lot easier hope you'll use it and let me know your comments on the discussion below